Okay, so this is a KGB trick uh, from back in the day, um, and that is to use a unencrypted radio to listen to any kind of radio communications um, that's in the area. So if you're approaching a dead drop or you think you might be, um, there may be some surveillance on you, uh, back in the um, 60s and 70s, um, what agents would do, KGB agents would do, is turn on their radios and listen for any kind of American chatter. And so the Americans caught on to this uh, tradecraft and they started doing the same as well. Eventually radios became encrypted and that uh, this technique has kind of gone away on the wayside. Now, nowadays, uh, with the um, popularity of these Baofeng UE5Rs, lots of people are using these things, um, as well as family radio um, and, and other types of, of radio services. So, um, what you can do is you can basically scan, uh, upload, uh, using CHIP, uh, the different frequencies on here from FRS to, M to MERS, uh, to whatever you think people might be using, um, and then scan and listen to see if there's any chatter. So it's a very cheap, quick way of doing signals intelligence. Um, the other thing to keep in mind is, and I've seen a lot of videos about this, which is people, you say, use these uh, radios as scanners, as a police scanner, and it works for any analog use. Uh, however, most police stations, um, fire, uh, EMS, um, any emergency services, a lot of them are going into trunk uh, communications or um, or encrypted in communications, and then in, that, in this case, it's really not very functional in that in the capacity. But if you're out in a rural area and play, things are still radios are still analog, you still might be able to catch a sheriff uh, um, or listen to um, any kind of like uh, university type um, chatter, whether it be maintenance and or or security or whatever. So uh, what I've paired this with is just a kind of a pigtail earpiece, which um, kind of gives you a little bit lower signature, gives you the ability to wear the radio on your belt, kind of walk uh, if you're wearing a hoodie or have longer hair or a hat, you could, you, theoretically, you could kind of disguise that a little bit. Um, you know, it's it's not the professional, this is not This is from BTEC, $8. Um, it's not the professional kind. Uh, when I used to wear an earpiece, it was, um, you know, um, a much higher grade quality. The microphone went into the sleeve of my jacket, and then the, the earpiece was um, customized. So this is this is just an eight dollar um, solution, I guess, to to the to the um, to listening. But it could be a very um, you know um, insight or could be a very uh, kind of a cool way to be able to listen to chatter of a, at a, like a protest or um, demonstration or whatever. So hopefully this was helpful. This is a the old KGB radio trick.